This is a Prince George's County Public Schools news break. Oh, I got one more, one more, one more surprise. I'm sorry. You know, we came up short last night, but I know a lot of you guys are going to help us out. We got to play the Miami Heat tomorrow. So I got 75 free tickets. So you guys come out to there were smiles all around at Charles Carroll Middle School recently as Washington Wizards star Anton Jameson dropped off free basketball tickets and $80,000 worth of computer equipment. Turns out the Carroll students won first prize in a joint NBA Hewlett Packard grant competition connecting science and sport and were rewarded with 25 laptop computers, inkjet and laser printers, a mobile storage cart, and a visit from Mr. Jameson, who loved that dribbling had gone digital. Just blessed to see, um, you know, science and athletics coming together uh, to produce some positive things in this world. And these kids are, are what it's all about. You're putting smiles on their faces, and you really are making a difference. And uh, that's the most important thing. It's amazing how far technology has come. But uh, the thing I like about it is that and making it fun for the students, you know, to interact with it and things of that nature. So uh, Hewlett Packard has done a great job with this program, and I'm blessed to be a part of it. But um, from the days when I was in middle school, high school, I mean, it's come a long way with the technology, and it's just good to see that the kids are really getting involved with it as well. Carol's winning sports-themed digital media project an examination of the transfer of kinetic energy using different sized balls used in sports impressed the judges with its sophistication and its star's natural talent. As a judge myself, um, I got a chance to see so much great content and so many things come out, but this one on kinetic energy um, really got to me because I'm not a science girl. Um, I'm more of the math and English girl, and I really got excited about your project and how it really, by being able to combine technology with the love of sports and basketball, you could really get across a great idea and a great concept. How long did it take you, Phyllis, to do that video? Sometimes Mr. Williams and Ms. Hugo, did, they would pull me out of lunch and say, oh, the video didn't work and all this, so then I have to cut fourth mod, then come and do the video all over again. And then some, one time it worked, and then they said, you can't hear the audios, and then they pulled me again, and then we just did it again. Show business tough work, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> that dunk shots and three-pointers are as much about angles as they are athleticism was a point not lost on Carroll's beaming principal or Mr. Jameson himself. It's so exciting, uh, as I stated uh, before, just having an opportunity to win the grant and then have children to actually receive the computers, the laptops, the printers. Um, it's just amazing to have them to, to get access to this, to this technology. And then they're already trying to uh, complete one of the programs which had the children finding uh, right angles on the basketball court. How has technology influenced your life? Uh, everything I do, you know, with uh, learning plays, uh, watching game film, um, I'm at home uh, on my laptop, you know, my kids are involved, they have little computers of their own as well, so um, technology is involved in my life every day, you know, from my kids to, to work to uh, just recreation, so uh, uh, blessed that I have it and blessed that, um, you know, I'm involved with it because it really makes a difference. Making a difference indeed. Thanks to the NBA and Hewlett Packard for showing that hard work and a little star power can make digital dreams come true. Did you guys ever imagine that you were going to win all this money? No. No. For channels 96 and 38, this is Dave Zarin reporting.